So a lot of the people in the workshop at the beginning will say, I'm not creative, I'm not an artist, you know, like I'm not sure I'm in the right place. And uh, when it comes down to it, everyone ha has something in their life that involves some kind of creativity, whether it's they really like cooking, or they love to dance, or they're a great gardener, or they like making home movies with their kids, or they have a pho uh, photography hobby, like there's something there that uh, involves some kind of creative practice that we can draw on and that they can draw on in their activist practice. We're looking, we're not training activists how to do activism. We expect activists to know how to do what they're doing. We're working with professionals. But what we are trying to do with professionals is to get them to think about their profession from a slightly different angle to think about making aesthetic choices as well as political choices, to think about what is the creative way to do something as opposed to just the most efficient way to do things. This or the in, way you always have done it. Exactly. And it's not in replacement of efficiency. It's not in replacement of the other techniques that we use, but it's really an addendum to those things. Well, it reminded me uh, that, that perhaps uh, we should be prioritizing a uh, cultural mindset uh, when we're planning our, our program work and our campaigns. Uh, so much of what we do in economic justice relies on, on data, and, and what we're trying to do is make data more accessible to people. But if data were all it took to, to change the world in a better way, then, then we wouldn't even have to exist. Um, it, it reminded me that we need to be tapping more into people's viscera, into, into how they feel, and and, uh, and and their values, and to really appeal to folks uh, at at a kitchen table level, at a, at an emotional level, and um, that 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 was I, I've got a lot to digest after after this weekend, but uh, but I'm excited more than anything.